Hey guys, it's Worker Bears, and welcome to an another or Emma OP review. Well, this is the review for episode three of season seven. Hmm. Flurry of emotions. This is the episode where her flur. He heart. Or uh, returns. And she wasn't really featured in the season six for now. He. He so. Oh. Oh yeah. Now this is like her return after her debut. Um. What did I make of this episode? This is kind of like. This is an episode we were expecting. An episode with Twilight really babysat her uh, her niece. But juggling it with other things made it more interesting. We also got a bit of side story with uh, Gaines and Chuck. The armor going to an art exhibit. Run a scan of the city for this energy signature. To be honest, the creating a sphere toxin. It'll take a few hours to bring the satellites into position. The episode as a whole was a very interesting one. Twilight, I had to just... Oh. I spoke to Dad. Well, so many things. I hate lying to him. And then to have Flurry sprung on her. her. And I mean, Twilight, even though she knew she had a full schedule, she didn't want to say no. She didn't want to let her family down. She didn't want... Hunt. The uh, situation to be Jim, that you got a way to find out where Crane's working from. Thank God. What can I do? Get your men ready. But, um, as soon as we've got a location, I'll let you know. All right. That she would uh, be no, as a bad aunt, you know. The the Flurry is the first child Shining and Kane's have had and. Um, I don't know if they're gonna have another one. Hmm. Probably not gonna uh, have another one anytime soon. Especially because Flurry is. was only just born, so. To what? And I, I don't know if. more expansion to the. Give up the. Will, will be. You won't find. He added any time in the near future. So Twa has to make the best impression that she can with her niece. And it's good to see he, that she, he already loves for her as much as, as anything else. Well, it really shows who's a good a character. The generator's damaged. I need to bypass it and power her, the antenna directly. Or to have Twilight grow attached to her extended family and, you know, just not ignore them. Um, if you're to pull it's the different. It's much better than you know, casually just. Oh, oh, by the way, I have a brother and he's getting married. Situation. And it's good that Twilight and, and Flurry are building up a, a good relationship. It seems like he really likes Twilight already. Although Flurry is a baby and she, I don't think she, I don't really know if she understands hatred. It is a viable con concept. It's a uh, more of a situation that. She, He is, of course, just a baby, and you know she's she kn she knows who she's 
she's learned from her parents, you know, who she's supposed to like and who she isn't supposed to like. That would explain why she was looking super pissed. I'll improvise. After, uh, at us when all the characters were released uh, in the uh, finale of season six. But, you know, she's going to attach to Twilight and, you know, even complete strangers. You know, she was. She didn't seem bothered by the. F by, uh. by anyone that like, even, like. S um, sunburst. First. Most big babies would just, you know. Re reject a complete stranger. Or. or they wouldn't be too interested in that. Your allies will help you tonight, Batman. I will be the end of you all. If they would, uh. Cry their eyes out. That would be the situation. And as it was, is it was good to see Twilight eat and Flurry already have a very strong relationship. This is when in the when I first saw the episode that. You know, told of that of Flurry's his imminent arrival. Oh, oh, the one where Pinkie Pie knows who's the uh, episode. I was thinking, okay, I from this episode, I want Twilight to sh oh, how m much of family pony she is, you know, she, other, than, other than Spike, he, who people count as her family, he, 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 she hasn't really shown any, she hasn't spent a lot of time with immediate family, you know, briefly, he having hmm, hmm, moments with her brother uh, during the wedding, and before the wedding and all that stuff, I think you should too. Have the visits to the Crystal Empire, but no, no like episode where that shows her going out for what I've got this under control. Okay. To you know, spend some time with her family. Remember, he just wants to help you now. He like she didn't have to choose that over something else. Well, this is kind of what we got here, but she tried to do. Who everything at once? She tried to do everything instead of you know saying, "I'll do this," and you know s someone else can do this, no problem. And I mean, I've heard some people saying uh, she could have had Spike, you know, go to the go um. Look after the uh, foals in, the, in in her place, and she could have looked after Flurryheart. Well, that's that's a that that is a good idea. Um, the problem with that is, and, and I do think it's a good idea, but the problem with it is the the kids. They would be, you know, they'd be looking forward to seeing Twilight. You know, they'd be looking forward to seeing Twilight. Scarecrow's men are guarding the antenna. I need to evaluate the threat and plan my attack. If that happens, this whole operation falls apart. What do we need him for? For the hostage? Contingency plan, in case the bat shows up. Yeah, like that's gonna happen. And, um, yeah. So, what did I think of this episode? Giving it gave me exact, you know, the kind of episode I was expecting. You know, it, it the, the lesson was... If I alert them, they'll kill the hostage. I need to reach a vantage point to draw them outside. You could probably say that the lesson was... Was, you know, predictable, perhaps. I don't know. If I can separate um, them, they'll be easier to take down. Maybe it was, maybe it wasn't, but hmm. 
one thing is for sure, or this episode, you know, it, it did what it was supposed to do. It did what it was supposed to do. And, you know, it, it was a good episode. But overall, um, again, nothing special, but, you know, it was a good, solid episode. Oh, episode that I really enjoy and that you could really get into. As a fan. So, oh, oh, on to uh, the marking, really. Um, I'm gonna give this a seven out of ten. I didn't. Uh, there was nothing wrong with it. I really enjoyed it. It was a very good episode. Um, is it ready? Flexible plates. You might notice a slightly. Sm Lower, Faster, hit harder. Small range. But you know, that's the same Send ballpark. Seven. Good. It's solid. It, it rings for er, each episode so far. No episode has let me down. Unfortunately, I know episodes coming up will let me down because. I'm allowed my opinion, despite what other people may say. And if people try to tell you who you can't have an opinion in about an episode, would, would, to spite them, and say, fuck you, and make a review about it. it. Everyone is entitled to their opinion, and... The episode in question, when I get it's that episode, I will get to it. The episode is now for a few weeks, so yeah. Anyway, oh, we'll end it here. Thanks for watching. I'm joint. Let me know what you thought of, of the episode, today's episode. What? Well, Mr. Wayne, let me walk you through it. The and make sure that you, that no matter what, you have your own opinion. We all have our own opinion. We're all allowed our own opinion. And no matter what, you can share that opinion. And no one can tell you. No one has the right to tell you that opinion is wrong. Don't worry, Mr. Wayne. Where you think something didn't work, I mean... You, you could have hated this episode. Maybe you didn't, didn't hate. Maybe you hated it, this episode. Maybe you did. It's like Flurry as a character. Or maybe that's the problem. I don't know. Maybe you, you might hate it for some reason. And that's just the way it is. That's your opinion. You're entitled to it. No one can tell you any different. I'm going to leave the, it with that. Until... Next week's episode will not be up next weekend because I won't have access to recording equipment next weekend and, and my webcam does not work. So, which is why you're seeing Batman and Arkham Knight uh, gameplay once again for this review as you did last, well, I was going to say last weekend, it was Tuesday. We both know it was Tuesday. So yeah, thanks for watching. I'm Joy. I will talk to you all soon when I review episode 4 and 5, which will be not next weekend, but the following weekend. The weekend of... If I can get my calendar up here quickly. Oops, that's... Uh, that's my calculator. The episode of the 6th that will air on the 6th of May.
which will be episode 5. But I'll do episode 4 and 5 together. They'll probably be in one video. Ooh, like, a, like if they were lumped together. You know, one is about Mod Pipe possibly moving to Ponyville. And episode 5, um, can't quite think off the top of my head what it's about, but... Is that the Sweet Bell and Rarity episode? I'll ha I'd have to look it up, and I don't want to hold you guys too much longer. This review is over. I know there is an episode like that coming up. I'm not sure if that's episode 5 or not. We'll see. We'll see. But, just so you guys know, I did explain this uh, previously, but you know, Better to uh, just make sure that anyone who didn't already know knows. So, thanks again. Thanks for watching. And I hope you all have a very, very nice day. Peace.